Today we've got Hamish from Recaro joining us. I'm Jo from Mummy and we've got three eager mums and three eager babies. We've got mums are Sarah, Katie and Martine and baby wise we've got some very chill babies. We've got Florence, Connie and Jessie. We're here today to have a um, chat with Recaro and generally talk car seats. Now Hamish, new mum, reading on the internet, reading magazines, Read the term Group Zero Plus Car Seat. What on earth is a Group Zero Plus Car Seat? Okay, so a Group Zero Plus Car Seat is a seat which is rear facing. It'll go in the car with an adult belt. Mm -hmm. uh, sometimes you'll have a base that will fit with the child seat as well. Isofix base, tell us, tell us a bit more about Isofix. Sure, so Isofix is uh, two fixtures on every seat in the car. You mm -hmm. need to check your car to see if it's got Isofix. Uh, they were introduced in the late 90s. Now we should find every car should have Isofix fittings. You see, I know the Isofix ones are supposed to be a lot safer, aren't they? Yeah, um, it's just um, a less chance of misuse. Yeah. And when you're using a belt, you can sometimes feed it in the wrong guide yeah. or whatever. But yeah. um, with the Isofix, it's in, clicked in, and, and that's yeah. it. Yeah. yeah. So, really, a zero plus seat offers a better level of safety in a rear facing mm -hmm. mode. And we are strong enough to take that type of impact. Uh, a baby doesn't have the muscles and the support in the neck to absorb that kind of energy. So rear facing is a safer option for a zero plus seat. Got Florence here in the um, Privio Group Zero Plus car seat. She looks nice and comfortable and, and calm, cool and collected. So Hamish, while she is calm, do you want to tell us a little bit <laughs> sure. more about the Privio? So one of the first things people notice when they put the little one in the seat We've got this head pad system here, we call that the hero system. It's to ensure that all the padding moves as the child grows. So you can adjust that on the back of the seat. Everything is together as one unit. So nothing's getting lost or you know misplaced. It's all there. And also it's all protecting the head, the most important area of the child, doing its job and adding that comfort as well. So yeah, no, it really is soft, it's, it's beautiful. I think I could do with something made out of that for me to snooze on while I'm in the office. <laughs> but it is, it is lovely. I'll let you ladies come and have a feel in, in just a moment. So um, the other thing about the Privia is it's lightweight, isn't it? Tell me, yeah. you know. It's one of the lightest in its class. I'm and gonna some, try that out. Some seats can feel quite heavy before you've even put the baby in, mm -hmm. but the Privia is lighter than most. So when you lift it up, you can actually lift it up and remove, remove it about quite easily. Let's have a go. Give it, yeah, no, look, I'm very well balanced as well. Yeah, so you're not tipped forwards or backwards, it's poised towards the centre of gravity. Off we go. <laughs> I have baby can travel, I think. Um, what do you think, Sarah? I think it's super. She looks really cosy, really comfy, and it's really soft. And she's settled nicely in there. It's called the Recaro Fix. It's very clear and simple to use. There's four indicators on the front here. You get a green if everything's good, a red if it's not. Two of the indicators on the side are for your Isofix connection. We've got one indicator to show you that the support leg is connected correctly. And the final indicator is to show you that the child seat is connected yeah. properly. And you'll see the indicator on the front goes green. Oh, okay, so that goes green. To take the seat off, we've got a very simple offering here. There's one handle on the back here. You lift that up and then the seat comes off and you're good to go. Ah, so you don't have to worry about changing your hand, yeah. juggling around. If you put the seat on the stroller, it's that same handle to release it from the stroller. So it saves when you're stuck in the rain or in a hurry. Come on ladies, what do you think? Honest thoughts, close your ears Hamish. Come on, <laughs> honest thoughts, you know, what do you think of the Privia? I think it's brilliant. I love the fact that it's won awards. Um, I love how comfortable Florence looks in there. She looks really yeah. secure and cosy. Um, I'd definitely, I'd definitely recommend it to my friends. It would definitely be something I would consider and and have you know after today seeing it. And you know Florence hasn't woken up, so <laughs> it's got to be a winner. <laughs> so what about you? Yeah, I love it. Um, it was really easy for clicking onto the car seat and onto the push chair as well. So that's a huge bonus for me. Um, and the fabrics and the, the, the comfort for Florence, that was superb. Fantastic. Yeah. 
Well, I think time time to wrap up, ladies and gents. Um, thank you for joining us for the Mummy Tea and Biscuits with Ricaro this morning. Um, stay tuned. There's far more to come.